Hi friends, here's a quick update from the 400 liter barrel ponic setup that was done a few months ago. The system is doing absolutely wonderful. Look at the broccoli setting in. These are broccoli plants. There is palak sag over here. Cabbage setting in here. Another cabbage over there. Palak here. A lot of harvest have already happened here apparently. And uh, look at the tomatoes. This is a tomato plant and the tomatoes have already started to uh, fruit. So this system is uh, pretty interesting because uh, uh, we, did a, we didn't do a fishless cycling, we did a cycling with fish and uh, uh, it was pretty interesting because uh, uh, it took at least uh, a month and a half for the system to you know, get fully cycled or at least for the first batch of uh, plants to grow. So what we did was we added, uh, after the first few days of the system running, we added uh, only a few goldfish, just about five or six of them, and let them be for uh, you know a couple of weeks. And then after about few weeks, we added another 10, 15 goldfish, and slowly you know built up the fish, uh, the population of the fish, and along with the plants. So the plants also we initially planted only a few uh, plants. One plant immediately we transplanted as soon as we put the fish in, and then the remaining was you know seeds directly thrown into the system. Isn't the system wonderful right now? Look at the tomatoes. They've already started to fruit. Let's see what the fish are doing like. So there are the few goldies in this. We are yet to add tilapias. I'm just trying to source uh, tilapias to get the next set of fingerlings. So this is how the 400 litre system looks like after 3 months including the cycling time. So today we are just going to give bring, bring a uh, build a small little greenhouse for this, a temporary greenhouse for the system and uh, as soon as uh, you know a modular greenhouse is made, uh, you know I will post a video of that making of the modular tent uh, greenhouse for this. So this is the 400 liter battle ponic. Thanks for watching guys and uh, I'll keep you posted.